No need for talk. Let's do this. Auto, vlog number 42 but guess what I got today something special and it's very special and reliable but check this out what has 295 horsepower 6300 rpms and 267 label feet of torque you still don't know what it is the Lexus RX 350 F Sport now you see what I got here today See what i'm working with you know what i'm saying listen you can't go wrong with a car like this this is a truck a proper reliable fucking truck and when i mean reliable it's not too expensive on the gas 
nowhere near expensive on gas and it's reliable it'll last you a long time and it's very smooth for a truck you know what i'm saying i've been wanting to do a vlog on this truck for the longest and my cousin he bought the bad boy out today so here we go listen look at that bad boy right there if that grill don't look like that that's not an f sport this is an f sport right here you know what i'm saying this is a proper f sport right here and when you got rims like these you don't even need to change your rims you know what i'm saying you ain't got to change your rims baby you can keep these bad boys on here but you know me i'm a type of dude i modify cars and i love how modified cars look you know what i'm saying grand fresh auto baby look at what we rocking with the bad boy mm-hmm nice yes sir shout out to my cousin d petrelli you know what i'm saying hit him up on instagram yes i did who do it the white boy hacha modify shit like this make sure you get proper rims and the body kit that actually fits the fucking car don't just go build your own shit and it look shabby get somebody professionally made to fit the parts on your car so it can look the right way now let's go red interior can't go wrong with that we call that the peanut butter and the jam we call that the red sauce you know what i'm saying we call that the 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 what you call it, the pink jam? But come on, baby, you can't go wrong with shit like this. Look at the fucking interior. You know what I'm saying? My cousin keep his shit clean, but at the end of the day, I don't give a fuck about clean, nigga. I came to do a vlog, so I take it the way how I get it. Let's get into this bad boy here. Shit low as a motherfucker, boy. And he taller than me. I'm like fucking five foot seven. Golly, it's a nice ass fucking truck, man. Put on the gas. Woo. Nice. You can't go wrong with shit like this, man. Me personally, if I had a, a big family, which I do, I'll get a truck like this. But you might want to get the one, the RX 350 large, the big body. Technically, the reason why I call it the big body because it's a little bit more longer and it has three row seats. This one just has uh, two. So you can still fit, you know, your children back there, car seat, the dog, whatever. You know what I'm saying? I like seats like this, man. So when I buy my car, I make sure I got the peanut butter, the jams, or the blue Smurfs. You know what I'm saying? You can't go wrong with shit like this. I'm being honest with you. But anyway, this is what you like, man. Something nice. Let's turn it off. Come on, Lexus, man. It's pristine at, at, at its punch. You can't go wrong with a Lexus. It's very reliable. You know what I'm saying? So if you guys got the money and you want something nice and reliable and it's not a gas guzzler, get a Lexus, man. Or X350. You know what I'm saying? Don't get no regular base Lexus. Get this one right here. This one. You know what I'm saying? Grand Fresh Auto. Go for a little quick stroll. The car's smooth as shit already. Let's go. So 
what I do all day, every day, every day. Shit, nice. And yo, you see, listen, let me tell you something. You gotta have a car that can move, yo. I mean, it's not a BMW steering, but this shit is nice. Look, left, right. I mean, it's pristine. When I mean pristine, you gotta have shit like this for a reason. I mean, I can't really explain, but you gotta drive a Lexus for yourself, baby. It's nice, man. Proper steering, good leather, electronics. I mean, like, Lexus got the best fucking technology when it comes to luxury. So is BMW and Benz and such and other cars, you know, but I prefer a Lexus because it's affordable. You know what I'm saying? And the brakes is on sharp. I mean, extra sharp. You don't gotta press the brakes too fucking hard. But I just wanna see how good the brakes are. It's called testing, man. You gotta do your maneuvers here and there. You see how those other guys move on their car channels. I'm not gonna do that because this is my cousin's car and I'm gonna respect it because he was like, if he tell me yo fresh, drive the fucking car, I'm gonna drive the car. But I'm not gonna get into all that right now. So we're gonna just, we're just gonna drive normal today. You know what I'm saying? Just normal. This is a truck, it's not a fucking racing car, man. You know what I'm saying? Nice. Come on, white boy. Shout out to all my fucking Bajans and my Jamaicans and my Haitians and everybody out there that doing their damn thing. You know, we hustlers. No matter what they throw at us, no matter what they throw at us, we gonna always survive in this motherfucker. Big cockroach, small cockroach, whatever the fuck you wanna call it, we gonna survive. You know what I'm saying? That's what it was made to do. Protect your heart, protect your soul, protect yourself, protect your children at all times. That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Fucking Lexus ain't no joke. That shit just scared me a little bit because I didn't even know this shit could move like this. And I ain't even put the motherfucker in sport mode. This shit got fucking power. Now imagine if you really put fucking power in this car, you gonna piss on yourself. falling in love with the goddamn truck already i'm like i mean me personally i want a bmw m5 but when i start driving other cars it's like fresh why do you need all that power for it's not the point i fell in being fell in love with bmws and i just gotta have one i gotta have one but me if i buy this truck right here i'm modifying dog shit out of this motherfucker it, it me personally I, your truck and my truck can't be the same this is a v6 but mine's gonna have three fucking superchargers in this bitch you know what I'm saying? This is a Toyota and Lexus mixed together, whatever you want to call it. This is going to be a fucking F Sport. Fast as cunt. You know what I'm saying? Spread the love, share the love, give the love, man. So we're going to move. That's how we got to move nowadays. Spread the love and share the love. Everybody that I ask to do vlogs with, they spread and share the love with me. So I'm just spreading my love and giving back to what I could do. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I, I stutter a lot, but I ain't gonna stop because this is a normal fucking vlog and, and me stopping for what I'm saying and editing certain things, it's not natural. So I'm keeping as natural as I can. 
That's why it's called Grand Fresh Auto. Let me try it again. Keep going. Doing it? Is it full storage full? Shooting stop. It's just that just came up. It, them, them, them numbers moving up there? Yeah. It's recording. That's what I said. I'm still. Subscribe, like, hit that notification bell to all so you don't miss nothing. What you got there? What you got there, bro? Fresh auto, baby. This is a hard day of work right here. Demolition. All day, every day, five days a week. But guess what? I'm my own boss. I work for myself. I make my own fucking money. I don't gotta work for corporate America. I work for myself. This is called demolition. What happened is, it's called deboning. You wanna see everything flesh. You wanna see flesh. No sheetrock. All these screws right here gotta get removed. You know what I'm saying? So what I do, baby. You know what I'm saying? Grand Fresh Auto. Grand Fresh Auto. Demolition, baby. Holla at me. I do this. Y'all want y'all crib demoed? Holla at me. Grand Fresh Auto, baby. I do the whole damn thing. Myself and only me. Give me four hours a day. And I have your whole fucking crib cleaned out like this. Deboned. You know what I'm saying? I got to go do that tomorrow when I come back in here, hit this closet up, take all this fucking garbage out of here. It's a dirty job, but somebody got to do it. You know what I'm saying? So if you guys are wondering, hey, what do you what do you do besides doing music and uh, YouTube? I do demolition. I do construction. You know what I'm saying? I used to do air conditioning, but this is what I do on the side. You know what I'm saying? Grand Fresh Auto, baby. One love. All right. 